Hey now, it's Kimox7 cooking. Yes, I know I have a lot of variety of visits, uh, videos here, but I'm going to show you a very quick video of how to prepare sea scallops by just throwing it on the skillet. I already have some garlic and butter sauteing here with uh, this asparagus, but it's as simple as that. Get real high quality sea scallops, get some butter, some salt, some fresh garlic. So got some fresh garlic cut up right here. And get those sea scallops. Every guy is talented with one hand, right? All right. Let's open these babies up. Let's see what we got here. I got these at a really high quality store. Not only do they wrap them in uh, the plastic, but they also then put them in a bag. So we're going to dump this bag. Well, you know what? Let's dump them right into the skillet. It'll be fun. We'll dump it right in there. And I mean, this is so easy to stuff it. The more you eat healthy, the easier you'll realize how easy it is to eat healthy. Dump that garlic in there. I'm gonna use my finger to get some of that garlic in there. Put a little bit more butter on there. I've got the heat at uh, you know almost near medium. Really, really simple. Pour a little bit more uh, olive oil on there. We don't want it to stick. We're going to flip these over pretty quickly too. Nothing uh, nothing too difficult. A little bit of pepper. And I'm not a big salt fan, so just a dash of salt. Look at those baby fry up. Amazing. Now these are really high quality sea scallops. These two of these cost, I don't even know. Basically four bucks, so two bucks each. I'm gonna flip those over right now. You see the butter already uh, in there. Let me turn up the heat a little bit. Now, if you never cook sea scallops, they cook really fast. So you want to keep them on here more than. You can go five minutes, or you can go about ten minutes. I usually go uh, about seven minutes to turn the heat up a little bit more. I guess I'll keep this video rolling until we serve it up. I'm gonna put some of them chunks of garlic right on there, and a big chunk over here. Let that some of that flavor sink in. I prepared this dish the other day, so I'm a pro at it. And I used to prepare it like a few years ago, but then I didn't live next to a grocery store that had high quality. This place I live next to now has got really high quality uh, scallops. Ideally, you want to use a, a garlic squeezer to squeeze out all that garlic. I don't have one, so I just try to cut it up with my uh, knife. And what we're going to do here is serve it up with this really part of my uh, new diet for the year. Sun-dried tomato kale scale salad. Check this shit out. Open this up for you. I'm gonna eat half of this tonight and then half of this tomorrow. Now if you don't know about kale, go ahead and read it on the internet. It is, holy smokes, good for you. I like it much better than broccoli because it's far more digestible and doesn't cause as much gas. So I'm going to eat about half of that tonight with the uh, asparagus and the fresh scallops, which are almost ready. Almost ready. We get some of that oil in there again. A little bit of that. Shake this up. Turn the heat up a little bit more. Put a little pepper on that side. That's it. I mean, those are basically done ready. So, hope you enjoyed this video. I enjoy Emma uh, eat those. You know, tomorrow maybe I'll shoot a video of my sweet chili sauteed chili and sea bass. That's going to be good. Good night. Oh, please subscribe to Kimox7 for all my music videos, concert videos, video blogs, and now cooking. Thank you.